financing for 24 months. A new Wi-Fi system that claims to cover your whole house with a solid signal for just 60 bucks. Does it live up to the hype? Find out in TechSmart. Wednesday at 5 a.m. Now at 1 o'clock, California health officials are updating an earlier decision on mask guidelines in schools. Good afternoon, everyone. This is the KTLA 5 News at 1 o'clock. I'm Lou Parker. And I'm Lynette Romero. In today for Glenn Walker. The state initially said schools should ban, should bar maskless students from campus. And they now say that decision is up to school districts. KTLA 5's Kimberly Chang is live in Los Feliz with more on those changes. Hi, Kimberly. Good afternoon and many parents and community members now reacting to these updated guidelines. The state's updated guidelines say students will still be required to wear masks indoors in California public schools. Now the California Department of Public Health said many schools can't fully accommodate physical distancing and their goal is to return to full-time in-person learning. So since there won't be physical distancing required, teachers and students in K-12 schools must continue to wear masks indoors. There are, of course, medical exemptions. Now, they say this will ensure all kids are treated the same and help avoid differential mask policies that can lead to bullying or isolation. Many parents are reacting to the updated rules. I think they should stay six feet, 